in all fairness, I think they should have been out of there quicker. You can hear that ice cracking in the video. So you know it was extra crispy loud to them. What's good, y'all? This is Kyler with BC. So you could probably guess who I am. In this one, we're going to be looking at the 40 luckiest people caught on camera. I think I've done something like this before, but these are usually interesting. If you're not subscribed to this channel already, get down there and do that now, please. I'd appreciate it. But let's go ahead and get into it. While you might consider catching the last bus of the day lucky, the subjects of this compilation had some major luck. If you want to be just as lucky, subscribe to our channel. This driver got lucky twice. Not only did he survive, he managed to capture this footage. This guy failed his trick, but who cares when the landing is this spectacular? This guy is so lucky, he only needs half a bowling ball to get a strike. That ain't, I don't know if I, I mean, yeah, that's lucky that it's a strike. The driver of this truck miraculously saved himself from turning over and masterfully avoided hitting the sign. Now, the way that looked is, like, he's been doing stunts in them big-ass trucks for a long-ass time. How did you not tip over in that? But good job, though. Either this bull felt sorry for the guy, or this guy is truly lucky. This girl didn't even realize how lucky she is. Just listen to the guy's reaction. <laughs> Didn't quite manage the backflip, but what a great plank. I mean, I wouldn't consider that lucky. All you would have did was fell in some water. But nice save, though. It was cool looking, but I wouldn't consider that lucky. Now that's what you'd call lucky. And this girl suddenly discovered her inner gymnast. Do a trick, get the second one for free. Now that was dope shit. How he all these tricks saw that hoping face for? falling and he just kicked it on up like a hacky sack. And this guy doesn't even need a motorcycle to overtake his opponents. Oh, Thankfully, yeah, he's he was lucky. Safe. He's lucky as shit. Dangerous but spectacular moment, wouldn't you agree? How is this even possible? I agree. Like, that looks like it's about impossible. You exact right timing. Milliseconds off. And you were fucked. But good shit. Do you know what's considered a lucky shot at billiard? How about a ball going into two pockets? There's no way you could plan that or out. When and your shot breaks the formation on that. someone else's table. I play pool. And if you can do that. I need to be shown, because I don't think it's possible. And this guy wanted to get his ball from the roof and accidentally hit the jackpot. <laughs> what is and here, the lightning just missed the car. A short tale of two cyclists that didn't crash into one another. <laughs> <laughs> Dude in the yellow's face almost got took off. He's lucky. And this guy managed to score all the way on the beach from his balcony. Nice. He didn't plan that. He probably the dog wanted got to lucky, do it. Being rescued by its owner. That wasn't And skill. then the owner herself got lucky. Thankfully, the bear did not harm her.
We hope the bear also got lucky afterwards. Instead of simply falling, he went all the way back. And this incredible throw at the last second of the game brought victory to the school team. Take it away, that's for the win! It's on line, it's good! I mean, I've seen that happen a lot. Like, it's not very common, but I've seen it happen like 20 times in my life. If you had awards for beer pong, this guy would be crowned a champion. And surfer Francisco Porcella used his fall to his advantage and conquered one of the heaviest waves in the world. We couldn't show you the next moment if he jumped one second later. The members of this Arctic expedition did not expect what happened next. In all fairness, I think they should have been out of there quicker. You can hear that ice cracking in the video. So you know it was extra crispy loud to them. If only everyone was as lucky as this motorcycle driver. That was a moped. Don't try to say that's a, a motorcycle. Flip. That was pretty dope. This unfortunate landing was spectacular, but most importantly, the pilot was not injured. And this swing forced this guy to perform some extra tricks without prior planning. Trampolines can be dangerous. Well, I think I would have shit myself if I'd been in that situation. Wow. When you don't want to be covered in cake on your birthday, And this guy miraculously avoided being struck by lightning. This guy was fishing on his kayak when he was attacked by a hammerhead shark. He was lucky to chase it away. And here, a white shark tried to attack a fisherman. If this surfer wasn't filmed by a drone, he would never have known how much danger he was in. <laughs> wow, he's lucky that shark wasn't very hungry. Shit, arms in the water too? Shit. That was very close, but still not missed. And this is the longest relay in history, but they succeeded in the end. And this animal rights activist is dancing next to a herd of 15-foot tiger sharks to express her protest against their destruction. She didn't have any special safety equipment, but she was absolutely fine. This helicopter was supposed to deliver the president of Bolivia, Evo Morales, but malfunctioned immediately after takeoff. Thankfully, they managed to land it safely without any harm to the passengers. Shit, in my opinion, if it malfunctioned right after takeoff, somebody was trying to X him out. Shit, in my opinion. And this couple decided to parasail over the waters swarming with sharks. In the end, people were lucky and sharks were not. They remained hungry. It's a good job the skier decided to check whether he can safely go that way. Otherwise, that descent would not have gone as planned. Either this was premeditated or he's very lucky. Have you ever seen a drifting sailing yacht? 
I think the girls it was heading for were very impressed by that maneuver. And this happened in China. And thanks to this guy's luck, no one was harmed. When you want to throw out some garbage, but you can't be asked to bend down. See, I don't think that one was lucky, though. That dude does that in all kinds of videos, don't he? Like, he's a professional with that shit. I think. I wonder if that's how he fixes all devices. <laughs> I guess that's the end of that. All right, y'all. That was a pretty cool video. I mean, it has some really good ones. But then it has some kind of dumb ones, too. But I said what I said. If you like this video, go ahead and drop that like. It'll help me out a lot. Get me in that algorithm. If you're not subscribed, go ahead and do that. I appreciate it. I appreciate you anyway for watching. But... If you have something to say, drop a comment. And until next time, y'all, take it easy.